Okay, finally got the, the amp out. Uh, thanks to the comments on the amplified video, uh, I am reducing the gain. Uh, this was completely shoved in there. It was the hardest part to get to, but no problem. I'm going to reduce this to a quarter gain and uh, see what happens. Okay, gain is turned, thank you Cameron D. Uh, the gain is turned towards minimum to the nine o'clock position as he suggested. And we'll uh, see how that sounds. Just gotta put all these pieces back together. Okay, I have reinstalled the unit, cleaned up some wiring a bit. Uh, got it zip tied in on this crossbar. I don't think it's gonna f move much. Hopefully, yeah, that's pretty solid in there. Got a lot more room than before. So uh, I'm going to do the reverse order, whoa, of getting the uh, center console back on. Uh, just get the clips on one at a time and work my way up and be able to slide it back in. And I'll... Okay, it's, uh, the hum is, almost imperceptible it's there but you know it's so much better so thank you cameron d uh quarter gain did the trick uh the digital fix that i talked about in my update video i finally took it out of the box and looked at it it seems like or i took it out it's been a long time but but it's uh it's this guy i mean uh I looked at it previously, but I finally get an idea of how much work it's going to be. But I think it's going to be a little bit of splicing. And uh, beyond that, though, once I get this thing plugged in, then it's really plug and play to the amplifier. So this this will replace the, uh, the equalizer of my stock head unit. And uh, I, I didn't need it. I uh, just got a little ahead of myself. You need this to control the volume with it because it you literally have um, no control of your uh, stereo once you use this thing so gonna have to install a little knob and whatever but yeah i might do this i mean i own it i paid the money so i might as well but uh that's an update on my update uh so for another time peace